Hi everyone, today we're going to learn on how to sell print-on-demand product on eBay with the help of Printify. So you know that eBay is one of the platform or marketplace that is pretty popular. There's a lot of people who manage their business over there, but most of the time you will see physical product and if you would like to know how to sell print on demand product with the help of Printify, you're going to want to stay tuned until the very end of this video. So one of the platform that also allows you to create print on demand product is Printify. There is other options for platforms such as Printify, but today we're going to work with this one. So first thing first, you're going to want to create an account on eBay and you can do that by simply searching on Google and then you can click on creating an eBay account and you can start from there. So first they're going to ask you to either input your data manually or you can also continue with Google or Facebook or with Apple account and you can choose whether you want to create a business account or your personal account. I personally have a personal account on eBay but if you would like to create more brand awareness or if you would like to create an account based on your business name, you can totally use the business account. The only difference is that you're going to want to upload some necessary data along the way when you're trying to log in or when you're trying to create a business account. And once you're done creating your business account, what you're going to do is you're going to want to go to your Printify. I already have my account through here. Obviously, you're going to want to create a new one too. And they actually have some plans on which you can subscribe if you want. You can see there is a Printify Premium options and here are the price. So with Printify Premium, you'll be able to get up to 20% discount on all product. Because if you don't know, when you're trying to create a print-on-demand product, you actually will choose on a provider of the product. And since there will be multiple selections of provider on each product, the pricing of the product is going to be different on every item. And let's say that you want to continuously working with one provider. Obviously, you can do that and you can probably get the same price each times if you keep on choosing the same provider but if you continuously changing providers for your print on demand stuff subscribing to printify premium might help because you will get up to 20 percent discount on all product and it start with 29 dollars per month and with those charge what will you get is you will get 10 stores per account because you'll be able to create more than one stores in an account and with the premium one you will get up to 10 stores per account you will get unlimited product design and then again up to 20 percent discount on all product and you can also order management with printify connect which is some sort of currency that printify have all right now that you know the pricing of the printify premium you can always start with the basic one or like the free one. That is the one that I'm having right now. I already have my stores right here, but this one is the Printify store and it's not really connected to anything. So I'm going to go ahead and click on add new store. And through here, you'll be able to see on all of the store that you'll be able to connect to Printify. We have Etsy, Shopify, TikTok US, Walmart, Printify pop-up ebay which is the one that we're going to work with and then you can also connect your squarespace your wix your woocommerce your big commerce presta shops and api so we're going to want to connect ebay into our shopify so you're going to want to go ahead and click on it and here they're going to ask you on whether you will want to create your new store or do you want to connect it to an existing printify store so let's say that i want to create a new store and then i'm going to name it sunshine store all right then i'm going to go ahead and click on connect and here they're going to ask you whether you already have an eBay account or not. So it says that first you will need to have your own eBay account, either a personal account or a business account. If you already have an eBay account, please select the checkbox below 
to continue the process. Since I already have one, I'm going to go ahead and check the box. But if you haven't, you can always create your eBay account through this links right here. Because if you click on it, you're going to be brought into the page that I've just shown you earlier in the video, which is the page where you can create your eBay account. Then you're going to want to click on continue. And then you're going to want to connect your eBay account through here. So right here, you'll be able to see on the permission that you will be granting to eBay through Printify. And the permissions that you'll be giving, such as view and manage your inventory and office, view and manage your account settings, view and manage your order fulfillments. And you can also read the terms and the surface and privacy policies if you want. Just going to go ahead and click agree and continue. And here, after that, you're going to want to set up a payment method. So if you already have a payment method on your eBay account, you can go ahead and take this box right here. But if you haven't, you can go to the eBay account through this text right here, go to payment and then add your payment method or selling fees. And if you scroll down, you'll be able to see on the tutorial or the step by step on how you can do that. Then once you've done that, you can go ahead and click on continue. And last but not least, you will want to confirm on eBay business policies and connect. So it says here that we've automatically enabled the mandatory eBay business policies required to connect your store to continue selling with eBay. It is important that you don't opt out of these policies in the future. Then you can go ahead and click on continue. And now you're done. You finally finished connecting your Printify account to your eBay. And through here, you'll be able to sell your print on demand product into your eBay. And you can start by adding product through these shops right here. As you can see now, I have two different shops. I have the one that is solely on Printify and I have the other one that is connected to my eBay. And on my other shop, I already have some product listed. All right, so here are the product that I have on my other shop. And let's say that I will want to start creating a listing on my other shop. All I have to do is click on browse product and then start adding through here. So let's say I want to start with all decorations and you'll be able to see on all of the product that you can design. Here we got canvas gallery wraps. We got canvas stretched. And we got canvas photo tile. Let's say that I'm going to work with this one's right here because it has like some black border on it. I kind of like it. And if you click on the product, you'll be able to see on all of the details of the product as well as the providers that will create and print this product for you. So this one only have one providers and I'm going to go ahead and click on start designing. And to start designing our canvas, all we have to do is upload a pictures and I'm going to choose, let's say, this one's right here. And then you will want to adjust it to be like some things like this. And notice that it doesn't really applies to all of the other borders because these are just the ones that are going to be folded into the frame. And if you don't have a picture yet, you can always start with the AI image. Or you can also take a look at the graphic library that they have and you can play around with the available graphics and i can also choose to change the background colors so it comes in different colors let's say that i want to work with the black ones right here and once i'm done i can take a look at the preview right here to see how it will looks like once it printed on real life it's also going to show me the back of the product so that i know how it looks like and then i can also choose the frame colors I think I prefer black as the frame color. All right, and once I'm done, I can go ahead and click on save product. After that, all I have to do is just add up some more details to the product. And once I'm done, I can choose either I want to save it as a draft or publish it. And that's basically it. That is how you can connect your eBay to your Printify store and start selling print on demand product on eBay. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.